Okay, I understand you need ore, mister, but there are bears right here. I did consider going up to him, but I do have a person in my fellowship, so... I didn't think he would appreciate the, the, the big level 100 going after him after it killed me. Wait for that to walk by. Yeah, this is all new. Like, you couldn't walk through here. Not before. Champ's keeping aggro. Probably not good. Also probably shouldn't have done that. Well, they've added a lot of new assets that they probably used in a... That new snowy area. These white bushes, for example. There's a... hopefully there are going to be some good quests around this goblin camp that's up here. There's a goblin camp up that way. That was the place where I would farm for my pages. And it was so funny because you would go there and there would be other people that are there farming. Because pages only drop from humanoid enemies. It's so weirdly specific. Pages only drop from humanoid enemies, which means that if there's like there's only one goblin camp and there's one dwarf camp here in the Missy Mountains, then you've gotta farm there.
Okay, I need two more of these, and uh, Mr. Flashback left me, so I'm. I think I'm going to say thank you and. Well, I will say that um, the addition of all this grass and that sort of stuff makes the place a little bit more visually interesting. It feels a lot more like Forest Shell. Yeah, um... I, I wasn't gonna say that that's why I was leaving, but... It was one of those things, like... Even though I technically I got off my horse to fight the Snow Beast... Like, I could have been knocked off my horse. It would have been nice to have had some assistance, but... I mean, that's the thing about fellowships. It's great to uh, have assistance in trying to get some of the... Especially these ones where it's like, kill 12. Great, killing 12. It's good to have someone else help you blow through them, but, um, you know, if they're not going to stick around and assist, then... Uh, actually... Well, I mean, I am playing with higher graphics and stuff, but I think that the reboot of Misty Mountains, they added this stuff. I don't think that this was here before. What? What? How can you have a sparkling treasure cache in the Misty Mountains and say your level's too low? Excuse me. There's no lock picking in this game. No lock picking. How can my level be too low to open a box? I will set that box on fire to find out what's inside. Now I really want to know. Yeah. Now I'm just curious because there's something I couldn't get into. What can I do for you? Stay a moment. Wait, what? I just finished a bear killing quest. No, darling. I I'm really not a fan of like kill 12 stuff. I can understand it, but still, it's a little bit like, okay, I literally just killed eight bears. Yeah. Wait, did I talk to Chloe? Yes, I did. So... That'll be interesting. Maybe there's some sort of bear lair? I don't know what they call bear lairs. Yeah, I'm not really a fan of kill quests. Like, I would rather do Angmar kill elite stuff. Um, that's a little disappointing to see. I can imagine, you know, if you're doing it at the same time, some of the ones in Riders of Rohan. 
it happens at the same time, so it's like, kill 12 of this and kill 6 of this, but then they both finish at the same time. Well, I guess this this dwarf chest is damaged, so that's I can get into that at least. I suppose I could just ignore the kill quest, but um, I'm concerned that they have linked it to something else. Peaceful starry night. Well, uh, yeah, I mean, the roving threat thing, I don't know if maybe they added it with that and it's meant to be like a level 100 chest. So it's a little lame that they would have a level 100 chest, just like randomly out there, glittering and sparkly. It makes it look like I could get into it, but I can't. That looks like a camp. Oh, look at that! There's an elite right there. Okay, so no stable there. <laughs> <laughs> 